What's up my friends? So I'm back bringing you another video. Today we're doing a pomade review and an update. So let's get on to the update. The last pomade I did review was the Iron Society, their new firm hold. This stuff, this stuff is amazing, okay? The, uh, Chris over at the Iron Society in Brooklyn knows what the hell he's doing with, with making this stuff. Um, pretty much, you know, this is up there with Dax Waving Groom for me. Uh, if you guys do not know, if you follow me on my channel, I love Dax Waving Groom. Uh, it's probably one of my favorite, if not favorite pomade. But this, uh, I don't know. It's up there. It's it's close. Smell really good. Hold is superb. Very good shine for the hold you get. Um, plus the you know the packaging on this thing is just it's just amazing. You know, just old school classic vintage kind of feel to it really really loved it you guys can tell um, really good results with it um, out throughout the day the build up was awesome everything was just good about this pomade um, I do love their other pomades his original and the VMM one but all, all three of these are really good pomades but I have to say if I had to pick one out of all of them it would be their new firm hold very very good stuff so if you guys do not have any of this I highly highly recommend it um, very very good product outstanding product so iron society firm a very very reliable good pomade good stuff all right so now we're on to the review now i've been getting a lot a lot <laughs> a lot of requests for this pomade it's water soluble and i finally got some i couldn't find it locally so i had to order it and i've been waiting for it in the mail and i just got it and this is for you guys out there who requested it this is Tres Flores Molding Pomade, all right? Um, now, I love the Tres Flores Brilliancy in the original. Um, it's probably like my, one of my top three favorite uh, go-to you know, toppers and shine products. I also do like their uh, hair tonic, the liquid brilliancy. That stuff's good too. And I have always been a big fan of the smell of Tres Flores. I remember my father putting it in my hair after the barber shop, you know, when I was a little, little kid. I just remember that smell. So, very, very nice, subtle smell in this one. Not as strong as the Brilliantine. Really nice and clear, translucent pomade. Um, really the lightest pomade I've ever seen as far as water soluble. Like I said, the smell is really subtle. Still smells like Tress Flores, but really, really subtle, which is a plus. Now, nothing in the hair, just a little bit of, uh, I did my, my tonic and, you know, some water. It's down. So, let's get to it use about that much for now scoops out really easy guys um, probably around the lines of uh, bona fide pomade scoops out really easy spreads through really easy and of course very very easy to get into your hair <clears throat> applying it first uh, right now it feels really light in the hair um, probably it's probably around the lighter side medium side of the water soluble pomades using a little bit more but it feels good it feels really good in the hair um, once you get in the hair you can really smell that nice classic Tres Flores smell so that's another plus so my first time using this stuff pretty much um, I used a little bit of it to stray down a few hairs the other day but I didn't really use too much. I actually let my, my father use it actually too because he um, he loves this stuff. He loves dress floors, and I gave I I ordered a a whole um, I ordered a three pack of it and I ended up giving him one of them because he loves this stuff and he asked if he can have it. So yep, gave him some. So good, guys. Pretty good. I like the way it's feeling. Right, a little off topic, but uh, just want to keep you guys, let you guys know what's going on with me. Um, so, you guys do not know, apparently I am going to college um, for uh, music performance <clears throat> and stuff like that. 
but I have decided this is going to be my last semester for that stuff because I am going to be attending barber school. Um, I am very passionate about men's grooming and barbering and stuff like that. I uh, really would love to get into it, so I figured just go for it because, you know, besides music, this is, this is my life. You know, this is what I love to do, what I love to talk about. Um, so, yeah, really excited about going starting in August when I'm going to be starting. So, I just want to let you guys know that because I'm pretty excited about it. And I hate school, and I'm excited about that, which is pretty rare for me. So, this stuff's coming in really nice, guys. It's slicking down really, really good. Um, I'm probably not going to be going with nothing too big today, just because I don't feel like it. But it's holding my hair is pretty well. Um, everything's nice, and uh, it's not like crazy sticky pomade, but it is good enough to get the job done in other words I do like the way it feels uh, it's not like you know overbearingly you know like feels like it's gonna be hard hard but at the same time it's not like really really soft which is also a good thing yeah so far, I'm really liking this stuff. Um, let's see, I'm trying to think how much I paid for it. I think I paid, I bought it on Amazon, I believe, for, I got three for 20 bucks, I believe. So, pretty good price for a water soluble. Uh, you know, it's cheaper than a lot of the rest of them, you know. So, I think for a can, one can, depends where you get it. Locally, if you find it, I'm pretty sure it's pretty cheap, probably around. Five, five to seven bucks probably, but you know I picked up a deal on Amazon where there was uh, three, three for around twenty bucks. So overall, you know, a good deal. And you know, ever since you know I've been because my my main two water soluble that I've been using lately for some reason has been um, Suavecito Firm Hold. I don't know why I've been using it a lot. I've just been using it a lot for some reason, and it's probably just because um, I just like the way it hold. It's it's holding my hair real quick and it dries up real quick, so it's just uh, allow me to really stop quick and get get the hell out, you know. But this stuff, as you guys tell, if doing a pretty good job. Uh, at first, I thought it was going to be really light and really um, not that much of a hold. But it feels like it's really good. It's really holding my, my hairs in place. Um, I don't, looks like I don't have that no, that bad of any splits going on. So it's, it's doing some justice right now. Pretty, pretty surprised with it. So yeah, there you guys have it. Nothing too fancy, too crazy. I'm probably gonna be letting my hair grow back out again, just for the hell of it. So, yep, you guys have it. Pretty, um, pretty good stuff. I was pretty surprised with it. Trust Flores. Um, you guys have any, you no know, questions, concerns, or, uh, you know, just any information about this product? Leave it in the comments below for the other other guys out there watching the video. But yeah. Pretty good stuff, guys. I'm um, pretty satisfied with it. it. Smells really good. Love that Trust Flores classic smell. And we'll be doing an update very, very soon. And I got some more videos coming your way. Um, you know that I've been uh, editing, so should be getting those up to you pretty quick. But I need to get this one done first because I know a lot of you guys have been requesting it. So, yep. So I'll do it for this one, guys. Be sure to rate, subscribe, and follow me on Instagram, and Twitter as well. And uh, I also wanted to let you guys know too. Um, if you guys could, you know, I, I appreciate you guys following me on here and, you know, seeing what I got going on and watching my videos, but my band also does have a YouTube channel that we just started up. So if you guys can go on there and, you know, and help us out and, you know, spread the word for us, in other words, that'd be awesome if you guys are into, you know, heavy metal and that kind of stuff. But yeah, I'll do it for this one, guys. I'll leave the links in the description for you and, uh, you know, until next time.